Well, we're here on the Quasar stand at EMO 2019. Now, the Engineering Technology Group, uh, proud suppliers of the Quasar machine, standing for quality and service, I'll say that before you do. Um, but what we're focusing on here is the automation element. Can you tell us what's happening, uh, what we've got to the right of the machine? Yeah, sure. This is a, a new machine to the Quasar and also to the ETG portfolio. Um, it forms part of our Discover Turnkey Excellence open house event, which is on the 2nd and 3rd of October. People can still register for that. Um, and it's fitted with the Euroa compact cell pallet system, which comes with 80 pallets and also a selection of voices that's available, as you can see in the machine. This is, um, this is quite a common theme these days, isn't it? Trying to get the automation onto a machine to keep the spindle running as, as often as possible. Uh, would you say that this is a solution, having those 80 pallets really does give you an advantage? Yeah, because obviously all your setups, you can just load the machine up and complete lights out manufacturing. The machine will happily run on its own, unassisted and unmanned. Um, the, the integration, all of that would be taken care of by ETG as well, wouldn't it? This, comes, this would come as a cell, really, wouldn't it? Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a new complete cell, as I say, it forms part of our Discover Turnkey Excellence Solutions. Uh, tell me about this machine as well then, Paul, the UX500 uh, 5-axis. This was recent, about, launched about a year ago as well, I believe, this 5-axis. It's been, been popular for you. Yeah, it's a very popular machine. Um, it comes with the Maxia spindle, which is the high-level spindle. Um, it's got a 60, 60 ATC, 15,000 spindle with 20 bar through spindle cooler. So it's a really good spec. I, I was going to say about the, the tools as well, because if you've got 80 pallets here, you, you've got to make sure you've got enough tools to be able to cover all the parts. Is that that's obviously taken into account then? Yeah, 60 tools are standard, so you can feed it with plenty of tools. Uh, what's the biggest part you could actually get on one of these 80 pallets? Then is, is there a, what, what's the dimensions of the part? I believe it's 220 mil diameter. Right. Okay. And would you know the weight? Um, around about 20 kg. Okay, so you could get 20 kilos parts on there. So the idea here is to keep the machine fed. What I also like about this system is the size of it. It's actually quite tidy isn't yeah, it yeah. it's sm fairly small it's a small footprint I mean, it's just over three meters wide and four meters deep so it's it's a very compact machine and where am i going to be where am i going to be loading my parts on this then is there an area around the back or, or do i do it at the front do it straight through the door at the front and then the machine will feed in straight onto the table and and, and in terms of the control talking to this solution is there any um yeah how does the integration work and is the software easy to use does it all go together quite simply for an operator Absolutely, yeah. It it's all comes and obviously through ETG, any, anybody that purchased the machine would receive full operator training on both the machine and on the Euroa pallet system as well. And now what I'm also envisaging with this is it doesn't just apply to this machine, does it? I know when at the, at the event that you've got up and coming, you'll have it on this machine. But I'm assuming then that ETG could offer this on other Quasar machines as well. Yeah, this, this system's fully flexible. It, it, we can put it onto a lot of machines within our range. Good stuff. So there is an event at the Engineering Technology Group in Wellsbourne. It's on October the 2nd and the 3rd, and that's uh, it's actually labelled Discover Turnkey Excellence, as Paul has correctly said. We'll be there, and I know you'll be there, and so will this. Maybe you'll be there too, and we can see you there. Thanks, Paul. Cheers, Paul. Thank you.